Tonight, IMPD is investigating 12 homicides that happened over the course of the first six days of October. Two of the lives lost a father and son who were both shot Wednesday night on the city's northeast side. Our Kayla Molander talked with their family tonight and they are hoping for an end to the violence. He got nine kids. Now they don't have a father. Father and son Michael Rollins Jr. and Sr. both died after being shot late Wednesday night. Family says Michael Sr. was a 39-year-old father of nine who loved working on cars. He's very lovable. He'll give you a shirt off his back. Don't nobody have anything bad to say about him. So when this happened, I'm like, well, who would do this to him? This is the first son that I had ever have to bury. And this is something that I feel like it'll be with me for the rest of my life. You know, that I don't think no parents want to bury their child. Michael Jr. was 18 years old. He was the eldest and a role model for his siblings. Little Michael, he was my, I don't know. Very loving, very loving. He was a very loving young man. He had a whole life ahead of him. He just got started he in just life. Got, his life just, just got started. It's like a hurt that I never felt before. I never lost any siblings. I still have both my parents. Yeah. So this is like a hurt. It's like I'm numb because he didn't deserve it. IMPD is investigating the shooting and doesn't have anyone in custody yet. According to police, the two were at a gathering at a house on Hillside Avenue when the shooting occurred. Michael Jr. died on the scene. His father died shortly afterwards at the hospital. Whoever's out there and y'all know something, please come forward. I hope whoever out there is listening at this, I hope they realize what they did, you know, because somewhere they'll be caught. The month of October has been violent in the Circle City with at least 12 homicides in the first six days. That's why the Rollins family wants to share their story in a hope that it can help bring peace to the streets. When you take a life, you're not thinking about who you're hurting. You're hurting the community, you're hurting families. Um, you took a father away from here to have children. Working for you, Kayla Molander, WRTV.